<gasps> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Credo. And in the last episode, we talk, start talking about this chick, and we're going to finish talking about it. We're going to talk about Actually, we got a couple things we can talk about. But anyway, um, man, I was, um, we didn't really converse. Like, we just saw each other in passing. And it's this is what was interesting about it, ladies and gentlemen. I told Derek about this, and he was like, wow. But, I mean, he didn't sound really impressed, but, y you know, one of them things. Um... Is that, oh, there's an animus fragment. Look at that. Look at that. Right there. Look at it. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Anyway, she's very beautiful. Very, very easy on the eyes. And, uh, I, uh, you know how when you look at somebody and you say hi, it's just like, hi, how are you? You know? And they're like, good. Well, it's normally just like, like a beat. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know how I come up with the words, but like, there's there there are beats in conversations, ladies and gentlemen. And you can hold a, a look too long, and then it becomes a gaze, and it becomes a stare. You know what I mean? Well, when I saw her, she didn't see me. She's like I saw her first. But then um, stole fruit from a vendor. You stole fruit? Oh, dummy! Only because my hunger has trumped my honesty. Oh well. Give me the key to these chains, and I will repay you tenfold. So you're gonna give me ten keys? <laughs> anyway, pickpocket the guards for truth you can do, home Dizzles. Right but um, Obviously. when she looked at me, like I was looking at her, and like she was, you know, looking back at me, and there was like that that look lasted like an extra beat. It wasn't just like you know you look around and then like you look up and then like a second and then hi how are you? It was like you looking around you look up and then you hold it. It was like beat beat. You know, on the first beat you would have said hi, but. Beat beat is when after, when I said hi and th like there was I don't know there there was a there was a it was a deep look it wasn't it wasn't like staring into her soul or anything but it was you know it was it was it was very soft it was a meaningful look if that makes any sense so I'm I'm I was looking at her and I said hello and she looked at me and s or well, she was obviously looking at me but she she smiled and then she looked down and she kind of she kind of blushed a little bit like, just a little like she was like eh, you know like it was eh, you know it was one of those things and I was just like oh my god you are too adorable right now and it was it's one of those things I had to talk about like you know that doesn't happen all the time to me but if it did is that the guard I need to and it was hey how about that all right I'm gonna pickpocket this cat steal the key I'm working on it can... hey hey where you going oh god oh, okay nowhere Nowhere. Can you get off? The, I can't pickpocket you on the ledge. Whoa! Is he suicidal or something? Where's he going? Whoa. Why is he angry? Oh, wait, no. There's another guy. Okay, here we go. I'm going to jump inside those people. That sounded horrific. Whoa! Get in there! That's right. That is right. You don't know. Fast walk. Go, 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 go. Pickpocket, pickpocket, pick, 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 pick. Gotcha! Go! I'll bring you the key. So, that was an interesting moment, and it really, it was heartfelt, and I'd love to see her. I wish she would have been my waiter, because I would have definitely would have talked to her, and, you know. But anyway, that's one thing I want to talk about. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I also watched Forrest Gump Monday, like a freaking idiot, ladies and gentlemen. Dude, I, that movie came out in, like, what, 94? I think, 95, something like that. And, like, I remember watching it when I, well, I was born in 93, so I didn't watch it immediately when it came out, but I do remember watching it when I was young. And then, like, I don't remember... I, I like, well, I do remember, but you me, it, it doesn't have, the I it didn't have the same effect, so ladies and gentlemen, kind of and you know where so this is going. Your it, um, consider joining our cause. Yes. To be an honest man, one needs honest work. Dang straight. Saul. But anyway, watch Forrest Gump, and you know, I, I didn't think it was going to have any different effects. When I watched it, oh, I didn't mean to, I, oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. See, one wrong button. And everybody tries to murder you. But I was watching it, and, you know, it was, you know, it was how I remember it up to the point where he went to Vietnam, and and then, you know, when Bubba died, you know, that kind of, that hurt a little, you know, it hurt a little bit more than it did, you know. It, I knew he died when I was younger, but it didn't have the same effect, you know what I mean? But when I watch it now, you know, it kind of hurt. I'm like, man, Bubba, you know, it, it was sad. I didn't, didn't tear up, I didn't cry, but it, I was, you know, I was a little more sensitive to that. When I watched it now, but ladies and gentlemen, but I didn't realize how much of a love story that this that it was. I knew Forrest loved Jenny, and Jenny like had her own things going on, but I didn't understand 
why she wasn't with Forrest, okay? But I watch it now. I watched it two days ago. And I see, oh my gosh, she's... I see what's going on. She is leading him on like you wouldn't believe. Like, or not leading him on, really, but you know what I mean? Like, she... She did what she did, okay? And she she was a bit of a... Mm, you know, like, you don't do that to someone that loves you, man. And I was very sympathetic to... to uh, oh, is this, a, is this across the water? Oh, it's across the water! Oh, get me on a boat! Anyway, um... Like, I, fe I felt for force so bad. I was like, man, Jenny, why are you doing that? And then, you know, I, she eventually came around, you know. They had sex, and they had a, had a kid, and, you know, she came around to Forrest. But, dude, when she died, oh, my God. I I cried my eyes out, ladies and gentlemen. It was so bad. Oh, my God. I felt like a little kid. But it's ironic because I watched it when I was a little kid, and I didn't cry. But I cried now. Like, I was like, ah! Oh! Like, whenever he's standing over her grave... It, buried her under the, the tree god dang it man and starts talking about little force and like, shut up Tom shut up crying my eyes out what is this what is this black dot here what is this let's see what this is assist carry the shipment where's the shipment oh I oh four of them oh what is this like a little side quest thingy oh huh. well, this is hip dude Etsy oh dude this is like what I do at work I take something and I put it somewhere else. That that's that's the description of my job. But really, why can't he do this? This is not like a it's not a very tedious task. Or well, I mean this is kind of a tedious task. I don't know if we're gonna be doing a lot of these, ladies and gentlemen. I've actually I don't think I've ever done this before. It's just a black dot caught my attention on the map. So yeah, I cried a little bit watching Forrest Gump, ladies and gentlemen. I was like, God. It's like what is wrong with me? But anyway, um, I want to talk about that. Oh, man. And then yesterday is something completely different. This is on the other end of, of the spectrum of emotion. Me and Derek, we, it was like after we played uh, Assassin, or not played Assassin's Creed, but played the Left 4 Dead stuff. All right, what's up? Multibene. Good work, man. It's good pay. Ah, Multibene. How much do I get? 500. 500 Florians right there. <gasps> Holy crap, I just guessed. Oh, my God, $500 for that. Go do that, ladies and gentlemen. It's definitely worth it in the early days. But anyway, um... For some reason, for some reason, Derek, um, or not Derek, but ladies and gentlemen, Derek, um, <laughs> he looks up some of the weirdest stuff sometimes. I, he was, I, like, I think he said his stepdad sent him a, uh, a link to see what your cocktail name is. Like, you got, you, you, uh, yeah, people on Facebook that probably, they probably saw this too, I don't know, but, um, you take your first initial and then the month you were born and it pairs it with different words and stuff like that. And apparently mine, being S and June, translates to uh, flaming orgasm, ladies and <laughs> And I try to tell all these people my whole life that they're missing out, and uh, that just explains it right there. Whoa, he's already level 10? Oh, he's a den leader? Oh, I see. We gotta take out... Oh, okay. We gotta take out dens to get... Select the assassin that promotes the leader. Okay, let's do it. So yeah, flaming orgasm, ladies and gentlemen. That is my um, my name as far as that is concerned. So I guess we got a den leader now. Let's go ahead and up. Let's go up top, ladies and gentlemen. Man, we got so much to do. I yeah, I think I'm going to take out those Templar places. The, ladies and gentlemen, up here these these are bomb parts and like little things like that. So whenever we go to make bombs, ladies and gentlemen, it's good to have the ingredients you need to make them. So. <laughs> So let's go ahead and continue. And there's the bomb places. They haven't popped up. You haven't been shown how to make bombs yet. And I'm trying to get as far as I can through this. Because we only probably got time for one more mission. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's... That's really all that's happened in my life is those things out there. Use your assassin signal at least one time. Well, good thing I've got one. Getting all these optional objectives in sequence too, ladies and gentlemen. Very exciting, very exciting stuff. We're probably going to try for another 100%, ladies and gentlemen. Man, I, um... We have a problem. Oh, man, it got a dark now. Real quick. Like that cape. It's like half and a cape. I believe I know why. Disappeared. Ah. Do you mean they have been killed? Probably. I fear so, but oh. there is no time to explain. So, it's, it's been interesting, ladies and gentlemen. But I missed you cats. Right. Above all, I missed you cats. And I've been trying to get back here the best way I can. And, um... Now we're back. Um, I'm still waiting on the drum set. I'm, gonna, I'm probably going to text John. Probably today and be like, hey man, I need to know. I need to know because I, if, if it's no go, it's no go. 
I then, uh, but I, like I said, I find myself in a predicament, ladies and because I really want here. There's another animus fragment. Hook me up, please. Um, I really want him to have this drum set, you know, because it's saving him money in the long run. I mean, if he's gonna get a drum set anyway, I'd rather him take mine because mine is relatively inexpensive as far as electric drum sets go. So, um. I want him to have mine because I'm helping. I'm not only am I helping him out, I'm giving him what he wants. It's like a, a double. It's, it's win win right there. It's a double win, double Windsor. But anyway, that's all that's been going on with me, man. I've just been. I've been. Ah, oh, no. I've just been dying to get back in the studio. I'm, but I can't do that yet because I need to get the drum set. <laughs> See the the problem here. I can't finish recording that uh, uh, the Wanderer by Dion. Oh, when does that? When did everybody else get double blades, man? What the heck? So what is this? Targets killed three. All right, let's go ahead and we'll call in our uh, our assassin right here. I'll see. Let's go ahead and get there. Oh, there you go. Objective completed. Oh my god, that is amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this guy up here, and then I'm gonna fly down and. Uh, assassinate that guy if I can I don't know if I can make that's gonna be a weird jump to make because he's kind of to the left of the of the zip line rope thingy or I could just shoot him oh you dead you lose he gone anyway oh whoa, whoa, watch out watch out watch out oh hold up can I assassin oh oh dude there's a second there where you could I tried to spam that button oh well let's just let's just jump and kill the guy why not right actually let's use our gun we haven't used our gun yet ladies and gentlemen let's have some fun let's have some our fun guys shut up dude shut up so anyway Hidden gun. Let's do it. Whoop! Bam! Go to the haystack. Can do. Haystack? Like the guy from, uh... It? I'm still waiting to get that movie back. Still on loan to a chick. But... I'm actually related to her. Anyway. Ooh, what kind of danger? We've killed everybody. There is no danger, Ezio. And even if there was, we've got Hidden Blade to help us. Whoa, was he dead? He's dead. That guy's dead. Oh my god. Investigate the signs of suspicious activity. He's dead! Target located. Oh. Or my assassin. Oh, I know that's a guy. Or, oh, that is a. Oh, is that a traitor? Right there? So, ladies and gentlemen, the coolest thing about. Um, what is this? The coolest thing about Eagle Sense now. Dude, there is an assassin killing other assassins. I don't like this, ladies and gentlemen. This is, uh... Was that him? That's him. That's him! Or is it... Well, no. No, that's my friend. No, it's not my friend. Follow that man. It is. Yeah, it's a bad guy. Bad guy. Oh, Chase! The Sentinel. Oh, Sentinel. Like, from... From Deadpool? I hope you cats enjoyed that, ladies and gentlemen. That's probably my most viewed, uh... Most... Well, most viewed in the, in the shortest amount of time, really. Um, am I supposed to kill him or just chase him? I think I'm supposed to just... Uh, I'm probably going to kill him. If I get the chance, I'm going to murder him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get him, get him, get him! Oh! Wow, he could have just killed him. Oh, that's not fair. That is not fair. Oh, what? I've got to... got to kill these guys. No, I want to keep chasing the Sentinel. Don't do it to me. Took our first little sliver of damage, ladies and gentlemen, but it didn't even move our health bar. So, that just shows you how awesome Ezio is. Oh! Did you see that? He has some kind of flying curb stomp. Dude, they have, they have just, like, if there was a knob to crank acrobatics, they just turned it to 11, baby. I love it. So what are your plans today, Sam? Dude, I'm probably going to um, charge my iPod and my phone. And I'm probably going to watch some uh, either Netflix or... I watched Prozac Nation last night, ladies and gentlemen. Dude, that movie. There's something about that movie. Uh, God, why do I keep hitting the mic? Stop it! Put it, put it up. Raise the mic up. That way, still hit it. Raise it up, right there. Yes, that way. Whenever you, there, is that, is that better? Is that better? I'm not hitting the mic. It's like adjacent to my my glasses right now, but that's okay. What time are we up to? We're up to time. God, we're up to time. We got crafting. Oh, can we just do it? Yeah, let's just go ahead and do it, and it'll get 100% sync or something. Oh, Mediterranean defense. Oh, we get to send our assassins places. Ladies and gentlemen. We are, oh man, look at all the places. We have to send people there to, to, uh, liberate the city. 
But we can, wow, we can just send one there and it'll already count it. Let's do it. So, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to really suck up a lot of time. There, like, um, what I'm probably going to do off screen, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to do the viewpoints. I'm going to do the, um, the, uh, the, the towers going to do the viewpoints, the towers, and I'm going to get as many assassins as I can. Hopefully, there'll be some that we can recruit. Well, no, I've got to take out more places first. So, yeah, see, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. See, now we've got, I'm going to, next time we meet, ladies and gentlemen, we will hopefully have all of this taken out. Going to get the viewpoints first, then we'll start taking out the defenses. See, see how they're just, well, no, it's not. The Templar places. Yeah, right there. There's there's some dens, a couple of dens to take out. I'm just going to take those out, ladies and gentlemen. Um, and then when we come back, I'm going to do everything. I, I'm going to buy places. I'm going to, like, I'm just going to, I'm going to grind right now, ladies and gentlemen. I need to get some money. I need to get some armor going, some better weapons. You know, now, now is the work time. And all I'm going to do, just get all the few points, do all the dens, and then, um, uh, buy everything I can. And then when we meet again, ladies and gentlemen, we will, uh... Well, we got thief mission here, ladies and gentlemen. We'll we'll probably start doing assignments, ladies and gentlemen. Probably what we're gonna start doing. And uh, I would like to thank everyone for watching. It's been my absolute pleasure. We're gonna be doing this again tomorrow, baby. And um, gonna be doing it Friday. Probably gonna do some extra ones Friday. I get off at nine in the morning on Friday, ladies and gentlemen. So I always love those days. I mean, I going in early. Oh, by the way, I woke up at four fifteen Monday because I thought I had to be at work at five. I didn't have to be there until six. I was like, God dang it, dude, 4.15 in the morning, that's ridiculous, but hey, I did it, I'm a good worker, what can I say, I'm the best worker, I'm the only worker I know personally, well, you know, from like an inside point of view, like I'm the only person I know, you know, that's kind of heavy if you think about it, because like, there's other people that you know, but as far as people you actually know you only actually know one person and that is you and that's wow i just like wrapped the universe around my mind right then so ladies and gentlemen thank you for watching keep it real i will see you in the next episode which will be recorded tomorrow i cannot wait i'm already excited for the next episode thanks for watching keep it real and peace